Ah, that's a trap. Fuck you! Trip? Oh, I had to trigger it. No way around it. Just had to get my leg chopped off. There's more enemies over there. Let's not go that way. Good. Okay, there's more enemies here, too. Alright. Fuck you. you. Guys are weak anyways. Come on, Triss. Oh, here we go. I think we've arrived. The Cascade, the Menhir. We need to take the path leading upwards. Gardens in the middle of forests. Those elves really like to complicate things. Stop they whining. Know? It's not far now. Sure. Let's go. Cedric told me a beautiful legend about this place. Legends are almost always beautiful, especially elven ones. The reality often leaves a lot to be desired. Well, Cedric also said the site itself was something wonderful. I've actually been here before. Maybe not. The rose must be here somewhere. I'll look around. Alden and Cymeril. Cedric said Cymeril eclipsed even Francesca Findebear with her beauty, and Francesca's reputed to be the world's most beautiful woman. Cedric drinks too much. He really has visions, you know. He really has the gift. He could learn to control it if he drank less. Right. Cedric drinks to get rid of the visions, and that's something I understand perfectly well. I don't know. It depends on what kind of vi visions I was having. Whether or not I want to get rid of them. Here we are. Oh my. Lovers. Look out. It's beautiful. Oh, lovers. I just don't Whoa. understand it. How did the elves become so cruel? The one with the scar had so much hatred in him. Places like this make you realize just how much they've lost. There used to be entire elven cities, and the forests were theirs to enjoy, not to hide in. Humans destroyed that, put them in reservations. Yorvith and his kind are taking revenge, though not all elves are like that. Kieran said there's a lot more at stake. He has his ideal, a certain vision of the world, but do you think there's room for humans in it? We're practically one and the same. Wrong, Triss. We've been learning from each other for generations, but we're different at base. I don't know why I find that awfully sad. Just like this garden. Beautiful and sad. Celandine? Nothing? What's this? Urbana? Hello, Rose. Pick. Oh, is this the Rose of Remembrance right here? Wow. Tris. Slimeril's Rose of Remembrance. Legend has it they wilt unless nourished with blood, and also if they're sold. But give it to someone you love, and it'll live forever. Here. This one's for you. Oh, Geralt. I want you to keep it. If there's any truth to the legend, it shouldn't wilt, even if you pluck a petal or two. Thank you. This is the statue, Curly. I'm so cute. Don't Aren't mind I? us. Imagine the corn we'll get. I won't leave the brothel for a month. Six weeks, even. Where does that woman get the gold for all this? I mean, her and the old man, they're buying a new house. And now these statues for the garden. Must be defrauding the treasury. What's a town chancellor do anyway? It'd be plowing hard to move. We'd never shift it in one piece. I know. We'll break off the legs, the heads, and move <laughs> it in bits. <laughs> break off your own head, clown. Ew. Shut your trap, cunt. Oh. Cutting deep. And Kill them! Hit the right. freak! <laughs> Not bad for a freak of nature! Well, I'm a freak of nature that is a freak because of the fact that I'm supposed to be a fighting machine. So... Uh-oh. Watch out! Oh. 
Ah. Ah. Oh shit. Ground gave out. Stumbled across the rest of the ruins, eh? Incredible what the end shape built before human ships ever appeared in the Pontar Delta. Elves possess a sensitivity humans can't ever hope to acquire. Beautiful. Ooh, free stuff. Let me just pick all of these ancient flowers. I'm going to talk to you. What's up? Looks like we're stuck. There must be another way out of here. Mm -hmm. Why are you looking at me that way? Do I have something on my face? Uh -uh. What's going on in that head of yours, Witcher? <laughs> it's time for sexy time? Yeah, oh, why not? You know, stuff. You could use a bath. So could you. Don't ban me, Twitch. It's part of the game. It's a good game. It's about to get raunchy, though. Yep. It just got raunchy. Yep. He's like, fuck this shit, I'm in. And that pool was not that deep. Not over yet. But this is a very hilarious part that I wanted to do this scene for. A witcher's blade. Letho comes here to think. Well, he's not here now, so we've no reason to stay. The Dwan stole the story of Elden and Cymeril, but they now steal our roses of remembrance. A more silly and shallow tale I've never heard. An enchanted wood, a beautiful elven couple living within. A handsome human prince arrives, riding a milk-white stallion. Bloody Dwan. We Enshe remember how it was. Limitless devotion, passion, commitment, and sacrifice. Legend has it the lover's sighs are enchanted within these very stones, though only those in love can hear them. Bushes, jabbering stones, elven hogwash. <laughs> well, 
I'm buggered. <laughs> well, I'm buggered. And we should take walks more often. For a while there, I forgot all about Flotsam, the Scoia'tael, the Kingslayer, the whole world, really. Nice to know I still have that power. I need time to devise the spell. It could take as much as a few days. Mm -hmm. What do you plan to do while you wait? I'm going to meet Yorvith. Well, don't get yourself killed. That'd be pretty stupid now. What are you getting at? You're about to recover your memory, which will give you a whole new perspective on things. We'll learn what happened to Yennefer. Uh-huh. And you expect me to drop everything and tell Roach, Hey, it's been great, but I've got places to go and people to find? You know, you could. I, I mean, you don't really owe him anything. I'm just afraid True. you'll get caught up in something and you won't be able to back out. Yorvath's a sly old elf. He's been fighting humans for a full century at least. This Letho is no common bandit either. And I shudder to think who put him on the warpath. It's a mire, Geralt. Deep and hungry, and it could swallow you whole before you know it. It possibly already has. I want you to know that I'm prepared to travel to the end of the world with you to save Yennefer. I owe you that. I owe her that. I'm prepared uh -huh. to drop everything. The trappings of court life, politics, the regicides. I could even live at Kaer Morn. It's up to you. Triss. Let me finish. I can only say this once. If you want to go alone, I'll understand. And I won't try to persuade you otherwise. I don't want to lose I you. I can't sure. know what the we'll future holds. I don't know what else is hidden in my mind. But whatever it is, whatever happens, I don't want to lose you. I'd have to be an utter fool and complete ingrate to let you go. That's kind. Thank you. Does that mean we're leaving the regicides to Roach and tending to our own matters? I can't. I really would like to go, but I need to clear my name. Foltest's men and bounty hunters of all kinds would never let it go. We'd be fugitives, and that's not a life I'd want for me or for you. Besides, I'd feel as if I'd given up when there was still something to do. I'd feel like I fled, and as I see it, we haven't lost yet. Whatever your decision, I want you to know you can count on me. I need a few days to prepare the spells. I need to talk to Zoltan about Yorvith. It's not a closed conversation. We'll talk again, but only after I've settled things with the Kingslayer. Right. So now, that path that I blew open over here. Hello! Gerald! Is that Roach? Gerald! That is Roach. Hi. There you are. Is everything all right? This is nice. What a beautiful place. Fuck. Very. How do you find us? Finding those I seek is a speciality of mine. Now, let's get out of here. The Scoia'tael are out in droves. No. Not yet. I need to see what's down here. I didn't get a chance to look. Oh, shit. I want to go out there. Can I go out there? No? You're not going to let me? Fine. I didn't really want to anyways. Alright, Vernon. What's going on, Gerald? Uh... I found go. a patient's chart in the ruins of the hospital. You mean the burned-down insane asylum? They committed him to the asylum because he'd insisted he'd been a prisoner of the Wild Hunt. He claimed he'd been in a world without humans, where he'd seen herds of unicorns. Right. He managed to return to our world after a year, only to find his children had died of old age. Following this, Vernon, it means he'd been to a world where time flows a lot slower. Right. Um... Narita wants the Scoia'tael gone for good. He didn't say you were the one specific, I supposed to give but this in his mind's eye, to. he saw them on the prison barge already. Yorvath's outsmarted bigger fish than the Commandant. Lorito's got something going with Sheila, so I'd take him seriously if I were you. You never know. Maybe the sorceress hunts more than monsters. Maybe. Spoke I question Deputy Kira, Commander. Yorvath's second in command. Where is the bastard? 
I get the feeling he's dead. Just landed on the Isle of Avalach. I've been to that island, Vernon. I remembered something while talking to Kieran. I was there with Yennefer. She gave her life to save mine. Did you remember the crossing? How you got there? With Suri's help. Interesting. What I find interesting is how a master spook like you has no idea what happened to me over those five years. Five years, Roach. That's enough time to topple a monarchy twice. First off, my responsibilities do not include the surveillance of dead witches. And second... Spit it out. Unconfirmed rumors. I've never taken action based on them. I need something. <laughs> Scraps, even. So you need to tell me everything you know. Even things you think might sound ridiculous. Three years back, Fenn got a missing persons case. Someone was abducting young people aged 10 to 20. Now the case went cold because no one agreed to testify. Except for one woman. Considered insane because she insisted the Wild Hunt had made off with her son. And she claimed she'd learned of this from an old man who was pursuing the cavalcade. He resembled a skeleton more than a man. White hair. Two swords Sounds on his familiar. back. The Wild Hunt is a riddle. A riddle that will restore my memory. If I can just solve it. As I see it, you're more likely to learn about the hunt from the insane. Not a reasonable man out there can teach you a thing. He might visit that asylum in the woods. Or what's left of it. Right. Fine, we're You'll wasting get a time. Let's go. To show your medal. If we're to capture Foltest's murderer, we'll have to clash with the Squiatel. I sent the boys out into the woods. Tough going, too dense. My scouts got ambushed and barely escaped. It's no picnic hunting elves in the forest. Tell me something I don't know. My people saw the Kingslayer again. He knows we're here, but he's not even trying to escape. Seems he's waiting for something. I think it's our move. Let's go! You'll get a chance to show your medal. If we're to capture Foltest's murderer, we'll have to clash with the Squiretel. Right. I sent the It's no my peep I think. Alright, see you later. So long, Roach. Alright, out we go. Probably only gonna stream for a wee bit longer. Maybe like another half an hour or so. Stream about two hours and then I then leave it. Talk to Zoltan. Uh all right, Zoltan, you bastard. What do you got for me? I need to find Yorve. Zoltan, I need to ask you a favor. Shoot. I heard you know the local Squiatel. You heard? Meaning some goat's ass in a helmet hollowed it out in the market square. I need some way to get to this Yorve. You know, I don't want you thinking I'm all chummy with the Squiatel. And Yorve detests me. Why would you want to see him anyway? He knows where the Kingslayer is. Yorveth? And here I always thought him a common thug. All right. No reason to sit on our arses. Come on. You can tell me everything on the way. Fair enough. Let's do it. Lead on, Zoltan. Tell me, who said I have contacts with the Scoyatel? <laughs> <laughs> That's what the why prick. he wanted to hang you? For making deals with the squirrels? What? I met a few, yes, but made no fucking deals. What about their leader? They say Yorveth's mad, but the Scoyatel are at his beck and call. Sod knows what he wants. Hope he'll tell me what it is. Tell you what, of two evils, Lorido's the beggar prick. Because he almost hanged you? Because he stirs up the locals against non-humans. And as what, he's colluding with Kedwin. What's his angle? Greed! So that doesn't make King Hensel would gladly annex more land and grant Lorido privileges. Come on, we've got the whole thing go. open. Alright, I'm going. With your tiny legs. Stuff like this makes sense that he would be slower than me because he's a dwarf. Dwarfs have tiny legs. It's just fact. Come on, dwarf. Now he's finally going somewhere. We need to go deeper into the forest. I hope they didn't change the password. Know their password? What are you playing at, Zoltan? All right. The Scoyatel asked me to command a unit. No wonder Lorita wanted you. Hiya! Okay. Go, go, go. Don't just stare at me. 
Go! This is it. I was due to meet them here. I know. They're aiming arrows at us. What? Garrett, yep. I know full well you're always vigilant, but quit poking fun at me. Give them the password. What them? Hurry up, they're edgy. Kierkegaard! Stop bawling. What do you want? Countersign. Heidegger. I asked you a question. Take us to Jorvef. Why? If we wanted to speak with you, we wouldn't ask for your leader. Jorvef won't talk with you. Won't you don't he? know that. Leave while you're still able. The two of you won't He's scare trying. us off. There are four more in that tree. How do you know? I can hear them breathing. One's sick. We're on Fistech. How? He's wheezing. What? You elven <laughs> cocks gone <laughs> soft? <laughs> we just want to talk to Yorvith. Don't fuck with the witcher. Wait at the clearing. The dwarf knows where. We'll let Yorvith know. Make sure you do. Come on, get out. I know what those elven pricks have planned. Been there once. What are you talking about? That clearing is a monster's lair. Huge horse son with a shell on its back. An Ericus in these parts? I thought that was impossible. I don't know the shit's name, but it's terrifying. They sent us into a trap. Tough. Let's go. It's not a trap when you're with a, rich, a witcher. Buddy. Oh, I almost made a wrong turn. Hup, hup. Here we go. Here we go! We're here. That creature prowls down there. Right where we're supposed to meet Yorvith. Exactly. Any ideas? I last fought an Ericus some time ago. I never had the swiving pleasure. Not that I mind. Wait here. What are you... Think me a limp prick? Okay. We need to upgrade some stuff. Or we need to put arachnid oil on this bish. And then we need to take a couple potions, I think. Me thinks. Me thinks. Petri's filter, rook, swallow. Let's go. Glug, 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 motherfucker. All right, let's do it. Let's do this shit. In me, oh. Okay, going this way. Fair enough. All right, let's go, Zoltan. Don't you get scared on me now. This is the place the elves mentioned. That thing approaching us is no elf. I'll leave it to you, girl. Monsters are not my speciality. Alright, bitch. Oh, shit. I got your number. Oh, he jumped in anyway. Nice. Like fire? Oh, he dodged my fire. Yeah, he doesn't seem to give two shits about it, actually. Nope, you're not spitting poison on me, bitch. You're dead. Oh shit, I didn't get a chance to loot it. Gee, thanks. The man himself. What's up? A lovely show, Gwynblade. But tell me, was it worth it? An uneven fight and certain death await you anyway. I could ask you the same thing. What do you want, that gun? Speak quickly before I kill you both. Again, I'm a witcher. You guys forget this. Okay. Um. 
Let Zoltan Let go. Zoltan go, Yorbeth. You have me. I have you both. A witcher apparently seeking an ugly death, and a dwarven traitor spitting on the honor of his folk. Though what I spit on, you devit! On you, bloody squats, riffraff, killing innocent men! Innocent men? So agitated when you shout that, it's even funny. I want Letho. I want the Kingslayer. Letho, the man whose crimes I'm accused of. If you hadn't become Foltest Lackey, you wouldn't have been there when he was murdered. Do you really expect me to betray a useful ally? He wants you dead. Letho betrayed you. He wanted to make a deal with your comrade, Kirin. Kirin Ep Esnilin is dead. Two weeks ago, his warriors were ambushed and killed. You should invent better lies, Gwynblade. He's actually on a boat. He's on the barge, wounded but alive. He turned Letho down, and his unit paid the ultimate price. If you speak the truth, Letho will die. But words alone are not enough. What are you really fighting What's for? What's your angle, Yorvith? You wouldn't understand. Hiding in woods, killing berry pickers, eating roots. We live by our own rules, doing what's necessary to attain our goal. You've lost everything. So it's pride that keeps you sneaking around woods and sleeping in ditches. You've fallen low, Enche. Watch your words, Gwynblade. No, oh, hey. What's up? What's at the end of your path? What is your goal? What's it to you, Geralt? Eseth Vatgen? You tell me to stuff it up my ass. Not Why everything would I? deserves that fate. My life now depends on your whim, so I'm curious. Then listen well. The two dead kings were whoresons who damned their own children to stay in power. But in the East, there's someone truly deserving of a crown. There are no You attack humans. and murder the people of Flotsam, forgetting that elves and dwarves live among them. That's no life. They've been stripped of self-respect, forced to live and die by human laws. They're more Dwan than you, Geralt. What's your connection? What will you do? You still Let's trust this assassin? You may be lying. If I'm lying, so did Kirin. We'll investigate it for his sake. We shall see how Letho reacts to your sensational news. Where is he? The ruins of Kelmawed. For some reason, he likes the place. My unit will cover us. Ready? Sure. Why kill Foltest? Why do you want Foltest dead? He might have appeared charming. But in reality, he allowed the elder races in Temeria to be oppressed. He was like old Dwarf. He did. But his death has more significance. Let's go. We need to go. Let's do this shit. We need a ruse. Tell Letho you've captured me and want to hand me over to him. And you? I'll be unarmed, hands bound. If you're not lying, his reaction will confirm it. I don't trust you, of course. My warriors will cover us if you try anything stupid. He'll know they're I following. It. I don't think so. Do anything stupid and they'll tie you down on an anthill, face coated with honey. You'll scream so loud even the storm riders will hear you. Are you always so grandiose? We could just tell Letho to own up. I'd fail men here yet, and better. Sure. Conquer with courage rather than strength. <clears throat> Thanks for the pathetic exactly. clap. Let's go. My warriors observe us. One wrong move and you're a dead one. Sure. I get it. I was just here. Literally just here and he was not here. Son of a bitch. Oh, there he is. Look at him. Geralt of Rivia. What's the meaning of this? I'm here to negotiate. Fucking muscles oh, on this, dude. The woodland fox caught at last. 
I underestimated you. What's your connection? I wondered what a human was doing among the Scoia'tael. My enemy's enemy is my friend. Know the same? The Scoia'tael are my brothers in vengeance. Joke's over. Unbind me. Right. Who do you work Tell for? Tell me who you're working for, and the elf is yours. We work for ourselves. We? The Kingslayers. Oh. There's more than one. Demavend? Full test? Who else? Who the hell are you? We've met Gerald. Do you remember? Nope. No. I'll never forget it. You saved my life. White Wolf. We fought side by side. Now we'll cross blades. This wouldn't be necessary if I'd killed Yorveth first. Sullet and orcs will drown in their own blood. Oh, I don't think mm. so. My men will finish their task long before the Scoia'tael in the Ponter Valley realize you're dead. Right. Who are Seret, Seret and Ox? Who are they? Kingslayers the Scoia'tael are assisting in the Pontar Valley, in Upper Edern. You'll answer you for Regicide. You'll answer for that. You're the only one who saw it happen. You'll do the answering. Uh-huh. We don't have to fight. This doesn't need to end in blood. Tell me everything. Enough of this farce! Vedrai Enlay! What game are you playing? One that you just lost. Oh, shit. Well then. Give me my sword. Give him his sword. Die! Oh yeah. Look at him with his big ass claim. I have to kill you. Try it, but I'm no king. Oh shit. Down in the dumps. Such a pity we're on opposite sides. Oh yeah, try to drown me, bitch. I see you still know how to fight. Oh shit, I'm actually fighting him. Why do you hound me? They think I killed Voltaire. It's your own fault for playing soldier ball. That would have would you kill King. I'm a witcher no more. You don't stop so being a with a witcher. Congratulations. Should have surrendered when you could. You fight well. But you the better ones. The muscles are metal. One thing the wild hunt couldn't take from There we go. Beat his ass. Oh, cool. A witcher and a few elves are enough to kill a king? You've no idea how many people were eager to help us. You really think they will all keep quiet? Your vest time is running out. The others will be judged and condemned for sowing chaos. So, why? You were one of us, Geralt. You saved us. Now we're even. Your witch is good with magic. Think she'll be able to teleport me to Edirn. If she behaves, I won't harm her. You I'll son of find a bitch. you. See you in Edirn, then. Get up, Geralt. Chase the dude down. Are you kidding me? Can't be that hurt. Where's Roach? We killed a few of his men. The rest ran. Is Letho dead? On his way to Flotsam. How do you know? He wants to find Triss. Kill him. Before he contacts the others. You shouldn't have trusted a Dwan. Let's go. We can't go there, Geralt. The garrison. Of course. I forgot what kind of warriors you are. Uh-oh. Mess Ted at Gwynblade. Good luck. Oh, 
I have my sword back. Oh, here it is. Return to Flotsam to save Triss. You bet your ass that's what I'm doing. Let's go. Oh, shit. Who are all these dudes? Oh, my God. Was there any? Fucking Scoyato? Oh, they probably took their dead with them, actually. That would make a lot of sense, wouldn't it? I'm sure there's going to be a lot more Roses of Remembrance growing there now, since the ground has been bathed in blood. Finally, we'll show the non-human rabble their place. Oh, fuck. The vultures gather. Ah, Jesus. We were too good to you. Fattened yourselves on our toil. What a bunch of assholes, man. So much disgusting racism going on here. Jesus. Race to the inn. Top floor or bottom floor? Probably bottom floor, actually. Do bottom floor. You're killing innocents! Innocents! Geralt! And now! So what'll it be, innkeeper? They killed my son! Damned elves! I want their blood for that! It was her! Calm down. You'd best calm down if you want to live to sire another son. Yeah. What do you say? You'll meet your match one day, freak. Thanks. Consider yourselves lucky, elven scum. But one day... Uh, come on, folks. Fuck you. Get out of here. Thank you, you Gwynblade. We'd be dead if not for you. The sooner we flee, the better. Yeah, get Take out of care. here. Save yourselves, guys. Who opened the gates of hell? I don't have any proof, but my coin's on Lorito. Rulers are always looking for a way to cover their mistakes and failures. And the mob always loves a circus, whether merry or bloody. This town will never be the same. A time of disdain has come. How did it start? How did the rioting start? They say it's revenge for those soldiers who died following Roach. But they were just thugs on Lorito's pay. Almost no one misses them. A spontaneous riot my ass. Lorito's staying out of it, keeping his hands clean. But his thugs are inciting the mob. I've seen several soldiers in civilian garb leading it. But you won't find any proof against the Commandant. I don't intend to. You'd think since there's so many people and so few people in this town, they'd recognize the guards on sight. Whatever. Why don't the guards do anything? Why would they? The squirrels slaughtered their cronies, and Lorito hasn't given them any orders. Have you seen Triss? We need to find Triss. Last I saw her, she was on her way to meet Sheila in her rented quarters at the inn. I told Triss about the megascope Zoltan's been building. Let's, Let's go. There's no time to lose. Let's I was go. lucky enough to get the key to Sheila's nest. Incidentally, for a big woman, the innkeeper's wife is surprisingly nimble. Wow. Come on! Right. Okay. Upstairs we go then, eh? Help! I've walked into a slaughterhouse. I'm gonna save those dwarves. I'm coming, buddies. How's about Death you stop? What sort of freak is that? I'm a witcher. It's that sorcerer. Go home. Go to your homes now. Oh, what? You'll enchant us all! Get the non-human! Okay. Alright, Vim. Vim Vigor. The other dick. No! Aren't you? I just about felt the blade chill between my ribs. Mobs always need a scapegoat after a defeat. Take care of yourselves. The trading One of them died. Alright, Dandy. Let's go. Sheila was in here. I've got a bad feeling about this. Don't turn the torch on. Open the damn door. Well, shit.
Not good. No. Not even a little bit. Don't just stand there. We need to look for clues. Oh, well, there's a dead guy here. Sheila's bodyguard. His neck's broken. No wounds. So that's not his blood. Triss enters, breaks the guard's neck, then wounds herself? That's stupid. Yeah, why would you even what think that? Somebody had a good time in here. Trashed everything. I don't get it. Someone else had to be here. Dandelion, look. What is it? Women next a door? A peephole. Someone might have been spying. The brothel's behind that wall. Maybe the madam saw what happened. Let's go. Alright. Oh. Let, oh. I'm trapped. Dandelion, no. Oh, shut the door in my face. Greetings. What up? Right, Margo. Come back later. See? We're closed. They've killed one of my girls. Yeah. It's Dry Geralt. I believe that. That was her room. What happened? They murdered her. Yesterday, they loved her, drank wine with her, told her she's pretty. Today, five of them came, drunk on blood, screaming filth. She had a client at the time? No, she was with me. What are you looking at? I was consoling her. I was hoping you knew what happened in the next room. I noticed a peephole. But if you were busy... We were. Until we heard voices beyond the wall. Schiller normally cast spells that blocked both sight and sound. But there was nothing like that this time. We started right. peeping. Me first. I saw that redhead, Triss Merigold, and Cedric, our drunkard ex-squirrel. The redhead approached the magic mirror and said, let's see who our Ice Queen's been talking to recently. She meant Sheila. Even uh -huh. I figured that out. She waved her hands, shouted an incantation, and a man appeared in the room, mighty ugly. Darai was so scared, she squealed. When I finally got Darai out of the way, a different figure was in the room. A woman, Triss, called Philippa. Well, shit. Greetings, Philippa. Those look questionable. Triss, you're looking nice. Peepers. Why are you using Sheila's megascope? I can't believe she approved it. That's like using her toothbrush. Sheila's oblivious to it. Uh, Do you think, the girl? Saskia the Dragon Slayer. Legend has it she killed a dragon. Right. Can she oppose Hansel's might? It won't be easy, but she's already accomplished miracles. So Why war she? is inevitable. Hensult can't be reasoned with. What, is she what the one did Sheila want from you? Isn't it obvious? Two northern rulers have perished. We've been thinking on these developments. Tamaria is in chaos and I lost my position. There goes the effort we put into building peace. What's your intention? What has the Lodge decided? I mean, it was created to protect the interests of magic. We'll adjust to the new order and make use of this situation. Five years of my work wasted? The peace of Sintra hangs by a thread and Tamaria will plunge into civil war any day now. There's nothing to use. We need to find those responsible and dispense justice. Calm down. Two things should be partaken cold. Sorrel soup and politics. Calculate and don't let your emotions lead you. We can't resurrect Foltest, so stop playing the Avenger. We'll proceed wisely and deliberately. We'll use the situation, understand? At least yes, help me clear the Witcher's name. Triss, stop thinking with your vagina and get a hold of yourself. The Witcher will manage. <laughs> uh, what's she doing Why in did Sheila come to Flotsam? It's a delicate matter. We need someone at Hensolt's court, but he hates sorceresses. I know. Hensolt's only son died in a hunting accident three years ago. The king has failed to sire more offspring, in spite of trying incessantly. Sheila claims she can heal the king's faulty apparatus, but needs very rare ingredients. Right. Which she intends to harvest from the Cairn. 
Exactly. That makes sense now, suddenly. This way a sorceress will have the king's ear again. That's all I know, really. Hmm. I know who Philippa is, but Dandelion. sure. Well, I know who Philippa is. Philippa, Philippa Eilhart. Eilhart, sorceress counselor to King Radovid of Redania, a grand mistress of the world's most fetid cuisine, politics. She's amoral in a crystalline way, so devoid of conscience that she's a phenomenon. Rumor is she's out of favor at the Redanian court, which, if true, she probably arranged herself in order to leave the capital. Right. What happened to Triss? Where'd she go? What happened to Triss? I don't know. I already told you about the only conversation I heard just before those murderers came. They kicked me and stabbed her eye. But I heard fighting from the other room. The sorceress was screaming. When the murderers left, searching for other victims, appeared outside. Thought I saw Cedric sneaking through the alleys towards the forest. He was staggering. Thank you, Margot. I owe you. Witcher, wait. Give this to Yarveth. A letter? The names of Darai's killers. He'll understand. Uh, you're spying, you're for, spying Yorveth? for Yorveth? I help him from time to time. Just give him the letter. Okay. I'll try, Done. but I can't promise anything. Dandelion, wait here for me. I'm going to find Cedric. Cedric's blood. I just need to follow it. And I think I'm actually going to end the stream here for today. And we can pick this up here tomorrow or in a few days. I don't know. But I do think I'm going to save the game and we're going to end the stream here. Get out of it. So yeah. Thank you to everyone who watched. Thank you to anyone watching this on YouTube. I appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed. And if you did, make sure to follow, like, comment, subscribe, all that lovely shit. And uh, as usual, 